we speak. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner, Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It's Porto against Paris Saint-Germain. Yes, cheers, Derek. Well, what an occasion it is for this club and its supporters. These are the games that they dream of. No doubt in there, the underdogs. But if they can frustrate their opponents, stay in the game up until half-time, you just never know. Hopefully we get a great cup tie and maybe even a massive surprise. Dangerous looking attack. Decent position. And they find a gap in the defence. Chance to cross. Well, it still could be dangerous. Danger averted for now. Well, that pass easy on the eye. Excellent position taken up by Mbappe. Keeper had work to do. And he'll go back and hand out a yellow card here. Yeah, he was always going to go back for that challenge. It was a poor one, you have to say. Delivery from Neymar, struggling to get it away. Neymar, and back with Gay. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. The cross is on. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. Oh, nice ball. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Messi. Verratti. Neymar. And now Gay. Messi. Neymar. An unforced error, you've got to say. Mbappe, well, a classic example of how to intercept. Idrissa Gay, Verratti, and there it is, the breakthrough, that will do nicely. Well, just look at this. He keeps his composure and he almost passes it into the back of the net. That's a very good goal. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Verratti now with Messi Jorginho Wijnaldum Messi very quick thinking there oh what a perfect ball now how about this he just needs to remain icy cool and it goes to square the game what a contest this is turning out to be Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, but there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. So, back underway. One goal apiece here.
Verratti. Mbappe. Wijnaldum now. Hakimi. And PSG pushing forward with options available. Idrissa Gay. He's in here. No two ways about it. A wild, wild attempt. Well, it's so hard to get this right, and he just couldn't adjust his body quickly enough. An incisive pass. Well, no way through. This might be ideal for the counter. And Neymar. And the advantage is with PSG. Can they forge ahead? No, chance missed. And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. Uribe. Crisp tackling. Well, as the stats confirm, PSG have had the lion's share of possession. But with the talent they have on show here, the lack of quality in the attacking third has been a real disappointment. They need to play with more urgency to win this one. Options in the middle. Messi. And here's Vinaldo. Chance to put them in front. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And relief as the keeper holds on. Well, he reacts so quickly, doesn't he? That's a great bit of work from him. And an attempt best forgotten, I think. Strong tackle. Might be able to set up the chance. The end product just wasn't there. And he was in the right place to intercept. Chances on. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Mbappe. Wijnaldum. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Messi. Hakimi. Well, just the tackle that was needed. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, even the best can't do it all the time. And Neymar hasn't been at his best in this game, Stuart. Well, that's the... And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Now, what can Paris Saint-Germain do from this position? And space for the cross. A poor cross, all things considered. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. 
And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop it. Well, as you see, it's not a good pass out from the back. It's on the wrong side of the plate he's trying to pass it to. It's intercepted, and it's a good finish. Yes, of course it is, but it's not good defending all round. to attack not an easy one to cut out really Verratti Mbappe with it and teammates to play it to perfect tackle well, Porto haven't been able to dominate the possession, as those stats tell us. But that won't bother them, because when they win it in deep areas, they've got forward with pace and with numbers. It's been a great counter-attacking display. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. And Rune now out on the wing. Could play it in. Now the keeper grabs it. Marquinhos. Lionel Messi. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. And space here on the flank. And blocked for now. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. <laughs> Substitution it is for PSG. with Hakimi that needs an accurate cross shot attempted it's gone in a goal for PSG beyond the goalkeeper to square things up well let's take another look and it's a very good goal and they deserve it you have to say they've been excellent PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. He's driven in the corner. And the problem not completely solved. Well, threat over for now. 
No nonsense clearance. 20 minutes to go. Over the byline, hence a goal kick. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason. He's bossing the game, Stuart, and giving the defenders headaches. Well, the keeper will be sick at the sight of him. He's been shooting from everywhere, and he's taking his goals really well. Danilo Pereira. Lionel Messi. Pass this time for Neymar. Attacking possibilities for PSG. It might be the moment to get them ahead. And it's in! They're back in front. Stunning scenes here. Well, here it is again. And I don't expect goalkeepers to save everything at their near post. But on this occasion, although it's a good strike, he should do better. Idrissa Gay. Well, that's one for them to pursue. No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? a well-timed pass well it all counts for naught Messi here's Mbappe save to keep the minute well that keeps it interesting but they're running out of time here well they fancy a short one Pull back. Splendid defending. Well, just listen to the atmosphere in here. The fans do it every bit to try and spur their team on for this equaliser. Well, they're nearly there, PSG. They're almost over the line. They want a victory. Stuart, are they going to get it? Well, what a finale we have here. Both sides have looked good going forward, but poor defensively. But I do think they have been the better side for much of this game. They just need to defend their box with determination in these last few minutes. Mbappe. Options in the middle. Neymar. Mbappe. Bernat. Every pass hitting its target. And hunting for his second goal tonight, however. Well, you're absolutely right. He's been on great form today. That was another good effort. Deciding to go short with this one. Neymar. Gay. Marquinhos. Herrera. Mbappe. Just the clearance that was called for.
Mbappe. And he takes us on. Well, the goalkeeper in charge of the situation. Well, having been awarded the corner, they'll no doubt look to put the issue beyond all doubt. And short it is. Excellent challenge. And that is full-time, really the worst possible start, you've got to say. Well, it's not the start they wanted. It puts them under a bit of pressure going into the next game. They need to bounce back now. Well, fantastic to watch in this game. And Herrera, Stuart, your thoughts? Well, he scored a good goal, and if I was his coach, I certainly wouldn't be worried by him missing a couple of chances. The fact is, he was a constant threat today.